Again, our continuing election coverage tonight in Stevenson County after flips on the county board. Now, last night, your election authority reported that Democratic incumbent Jim Hart lost District D with that seat, now going to Republican Dale Diddens. He won that race 54 to 46 percent. However, District E flipped blue with Democrat Lynette Williams taking 52 percent of the vote, beating out Republican incumbent Kurt Copeland. Right now, though, one race is still tight, and that's District C, where Republican Todd McKenna leads incumbent Democrat Casey Anthony by only five votes in a race that's too close to call. And tonight, we're getting reaction from Stevenson County leaders as the results pour in. Yeah, Vice Chairman of the Board Tim Whalen says they were aware of how close these races might be, leaving them pretty much unfazed by the results that ended up coming down. I don't think so. I think it was... Um I had hoped we would take all three, obviously, as a Republican, but um, I think that uh, the race with um, with Kurt um, and Miss William, Mrs. Williams was well. That one and the one with with Casey Anthony and uh, Tom McKenna was were always going to be close. So. Well, Whalen says more of the changes could come for board members as they reorganize certain committees, which is set to be done at a board meeting December 1st.